Hey guys, it's your boy Liddy here. Today I'm teaching you how to grow corn. As you can see, this is one of the corn that was uh, in the little um, um, peat pots and it's growing up pretty nicely as you can see. Sorry if it's been a long time. I just never had access to a fin or a camera or whatever. whoop de whoop de but check these out. These are really good. And it's been like two to three weeks since I posted another video. I'm just showing you the, you know, what it looks like right now these are plants growing without any nutrients no compost nothing and these plants are doing pretty good and also I have even more corn growing in rows so we're gonna have a really good time you know growing corn and all that there so everybody likes the corn peas and carrots and you have a little piece of meat some fish chicken or you have some hamburger beef oxtail whatever or curry goat I don't care and like, you know, if you're hungry, you're hungry, but for me, growing vegetables is such a natural and peaceful hobby. It's like, I just enjoy growing things. Like, I just like, like, even that lemon tree right there, like, I just like growing things. It just takes a lot off my mind, you know, like, even though when you grow vegetables, it's just like raising a child, you know, just like raising a puppy, a kitten, anything as a baby from seed to, you know, fully grown. So, yeah, so this is corn, guys, um. Yeah, it's been a while, I mean, as you can see, the biodegradable pots do work, as you can see, they've gotten bigger, and they have, you know, growing taller, just the biggest corn stalks I have, so yeah, probably in two more months, I should probably have something, you know, decent, like a nice decent corn stalk to be like, you know, growing out of the ground, have some good sweet corn, and I can show you how to pick the seeds out of the corn and plant it again, pretty simple, I mean, you know, so you can always have corn, you can always, you know, Enjoy the reproductive cycle of it and all that there. But uh, make sure you have plenty of sunlight. Give it plenty of water. And, you know, I'm going to teach you how to make my very own compost. But that's simple. What you got to do is get potting soil. Mix it with a bunch of kitchen waste. Like um, leftover vegetables and all that. You can even get dead leaves off trees, sticks and all that. And, and make sure you have vegetables and all that to rot in your soil. And all you got to do is water it every day. For a whole year to make compost. Some vegetables don't take long to biodegrade. But yeah that's a good way to you know fertilize and all that. But if you want some quick fertilizer you can use chicken manure. That's a good one. Or some earthworm castings which is good. And it will help you grow good corn. And uh, yeah if you're wondering what this is. This is cochineal. A good plant to make drink out of. And this one. Uh, this corn fell right down. This this corn fell right down. Just straight. I'm just straighten you up. He fell right over. And it's like wow. I'm just straighten you up. Oh that dear. Okay, now I'm standing up straight. Good. So these corn are literally a week and a half old, you guys. A week and a half old, and this thing right here going on, going on for at least a month. I know. It's just that, you know, I haven't really been taking care of them. I haven't really put nutrients on them so they can grow better. But, yeah. That's really just a corn stalk growing good. And also, I'm going to do all the tutorials too. Like, all the other plants in my yard. Those things are doing good and all that. But we're going to get to it. So, we're just talking about corn. And, you know, to be honest, the way I eat corn, I do not like putting it in a pot. Make the corn hot. Yada, yada. As soon as that corn's... You know, growing straight out the corn stalk. I take it, I peel it, and eat it just like that. Because, like, I swear you get more flavor from eating corn like that rather than, you know, heating it up. I swear, you, I swear, right? You're losing juices and flavor when you do that. To me, I just like eating the corn just like that. But, yeah, it, you know, this is good corn to grow in Bermuda, you know, sweet corn, you know. So nice. I mean, the soil from Bermuda makes the vegetable taste so sweet, you know. So, yeah, this is just how to grow corn from seed to harvest. And, um, you know, it's probably going to be two months until harvest. So, yeah. And this is looking pretty good. Pretty good start. And, uh, yeah. And this is a grapevine that died. Been transplanted way too many times. Once you put it in the ground, you have to leave it. Find a good spot. Or it will turn like this and die out, you know. You don't want that. But, uh, yeah. Some good, you know, corn, corn seeds and all that there, yeah. 
this is a uh, papaya tree papaya tree and right here are banana trees but I'll do that for another video have more corn and if you're wondering what all this is in a row these are actually carrots and uh, yeah pretty much stuff like that there I mean my garden is gonna be you know battle for the summer and by the time summertime comes I'll show you how to grow a lot of watermelon and all that there. Once I get watermelon grain with some squash and all that, I'll show you how to grow all that. Now, this video is mostly focused on corn. So, yeah, this is how to grow corn 2023, all that there. Yeah, pretty much. So, don't forget to uh, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.